All right, there, guys, welcome back to the channel. So I've got it set up for your idea, as you can tell as well by the title of this video. Liverpool are loaning out some more youngsters, which you might be thinking to yourself, Adam, that's not a bad thing. And you said that some of these players should go out and loan themselves due to the injuries that they've had. And you'd be correct. But we're weakening the squad by doing this, guys. You know, if we're going to have successful cut runs, it looks to me that we are already saying that we won't be taking the FA Carabao Cup seriously, which some of you may not be bothered about, guys. But we did win the Carabao on the back of the kids playing successfully. Bobby Clark sold him. He's gone. Um, and yeah, it just... I don't know, guys. Let's see if we actually bring some players in and see if I have a different feeling come the end of the transfer window. But it is, it is looking a little bit on the heavy of people leaving Liverpool. It's looking a bit more of a bit of a... I won't, I won't say a cull, but you know what I mean? Like cutting the wage bill or something like that. I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm wrong, but that's just a feeling I've got right now. Let's see exactly what happens come the end of the window. But anyway, before I get to that, just a little quick reminder to subscribe to the channel, like the video, and leave a comment down below, guys, to let me know your thoughts. So, first and foremost, guys, we've got the Fabrizio Mano, James Pierce talking about Tyler Morton. Start with Romano. He says that Bayer Leverkusen and Liverpool are in contact over Tyler Morton. Deal on loan with a buy clause. So basically, they would have the option to buy him come the end of, you know, the loan. Details being discussed as Paul Joyce reported yesterday. We did touch on Tyler Morton last night after the stream in that video. Did touch on that in that, especially the Cheheza stuff as well. I don't know what I was trying to say to start with then. And then James Pierce has followed that up with... Decision expected today over whether Liverpool loan Tyler Morton to buy a Leverkusen would be a big opportunity for him with the Bundesliga champions. And it would be. You know, he went out on loan last year, excelled. Many people thought he would come into the Liverpool squad this year and play a bit with Liverpool. But he's off to the German champions by the looks of things as it stands. This was followed up by... Romano tweeting about RB Salzburg. I mean, advanced talks to sign Stefan Baitetic on loan from Liverpool. Negotiations are at the final stage with details to be clarified, but already underway as Pep Linders wants Stefan. Clubs in Spain also wanted him, but RB Salzburg are now close. Now, obviously, he'll be going to join Bobby Clark, who Liverpool sold to Salzburg, and Pep Linders, the old assistant manager at Liverpool. I think Stefan Bajtetic did need a loan, especially after the injury he sustained last year. Going to a league like Salzburg may not be the best. I'm not too sure if Salzburg are in Europe this year. I would presume that they are. Um, so if he gets to play in that, more power to him. That's a bit more of a, the experience he would need. Petlinders knows how to use him, so he would gain match experience, match confidence in a get a bit more match fit by going out there, you would hope to think. And again, there's no mention of like a buy option here. So this is just a straight loan. So that might bode well for the future for Liverpool in regards to him coming back and potentially, you know, kicking on in the number six role from potentially next year. And then lastly, guys, we've got the last one here. James Pierce saying that Owen Beck is set to complete a loan move to Blackburn today. Great opportunity for him after an impressive year at Dundee in 23-24. Again, Blackburn Rovers seem to be a team that Liverpool loan kids out to and they excel. You know, we had Harvey Elliott who did that, I think, initially, followed by Tyler Morton last year. Um, and then it looks like Owen Beck's going the same way also. You know, I did think maybe this kid would be kept around as a bit of a left-back backup in case we ended up did moving on either Robbo or Simicast. Obviously, that's not the case. But again, no mention of a buy option. So this could be just to get him out there, get him some minutes. And then next year, if we do end up moving on a Simicast or a Robbo, he's there ready to come in and become an understudy um, for whichever one is still there. Maybe we have a new left back. Who knows, guys? But anyway, that's it for this video. Let me know down below your thoughts on all of this. And, you know, guys, we've got, what is it? Three and a bit days left now, the transfer window. Let's see if Liverpool can pull something out of the hat, yeah? Let's see what happens, guys. Anyway, if anything else breaks today, guys, I'll be back with a video. But until then, I'll catch you in the next one.